everybody. I'm Mr. Avon Independent Sales Representative for New Avon LLC in the United States of America, and I am coming on to share with you some sales tips for Avon Campaign 11 and 12 of 2017. And so I will be mostly gearing this, to, like I said, for the selling tips for representatives, but I'll also be talking a little bit about, about what's going to be in store as far as customers looking for new products. Um, so, hello, thank you for popping on. So, Avon Campaign 11 is both basic, the, 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 I got tongue tied there, <laughs> is um, gonna be featuring the Bug Guard back. And so, Bug Guard um, is gonna be your like top, top thing for on Campaign 11. And so, the sale prices in Campaign 11 for the pump sprays and the towelette. Is ninety nine for the family size pump sprays. It's going to be twelve ninety nine, and for, for the aerosol sprays seven ninety nine, and the lotions are six ninety nine. And now that is going to be the introductory, well, introductory slash intro, um, this year's launch prices um, for your customers. And then the the it's really four ninety nine. Um, and so in our what's new for campaign 11 there is some information on the products as well as a uh, opportunity for you to get it um, and you can have unlimited quantities so it's not do the demo limits in this case and um, so bug art is just definitely a good thing to cap capitalize on. and I will say though be careful about ordering too much for inventory if you don't have a plan to sell it because this is something that because a lot of the products have SPF they are going to eventually expire and, and you just don't want to get too much and end up having product that expires um, a couple years from now so um, what I would do is I would say focus mostly on what you're doing as far as um, like marketing the product to the customer Customers making the orders and then ordering it with your order. And so a good way to do the what's news is now with campaigns nine and ten, you can take pre-orders and order it out of the what's new. And then um, you know those people can have it at the sale price before it even hits the brochure. Um, and then campaign eleven is also going to have a new Avon senses scent called the Lisse is, I think, how you say it, but it's lemon blossom and basil is what it is, and so it's going to be a shower gel, body lotion, and body spray. And there's a opportunity in here for you to get um, a, a demo of it. And it says that the notes are sweet lemons, peony blossoms, and fresh basil. And um, um, so the limited edition Avon senses. And then I was noticing earlier that there is some. Um, Father Men's fragrance tips right here. <laughs> um, as well as some of our men's fragrances are in the what's new for representative purchase. And then there's also some information on the, the a new line eraser with retinol um, and also the targeted treatment with retinol. And so that's definitely that. That's why it's really important to look through your what's news because. Even if you don't end up getting any demo products, which again, I mean, demo products really should be things that you're going to get that you're going to use yourself um, or things that you know you have a plan to sell it. Or like I said, if you want to do the pre-order deal, um, that's really how the demos should be used as far as the purchasing goes. But as far as the valuable information that comes from these what's new, it's so important to look through here and get your information on things like your products for a new and the stick. Um, there's Lip Tips 101 on page 10 of the What's New for Campaign 11 that's talking about what you can make use of lipstick samples and also to, even if not the samples, just letting people know, hey, we do offer a 100% money back guarantee if you get something that you really don't like, but also just realize you know that makeup has no rules that's one of the tips <laughs> um, and stuff like that so there really is a good uh,
reason, like I said, to be looking at these what's news. And this is also where you're going to most of your sample information and pricing. And then campaign 11, besides the bug guard, there is some new cute spring jewelry things that, as you guys that are representatives know, our brochures do not do our jewelry. Pieces, but so you can see there's some statement pieces and some new sterling silver pieces. And these pieces here, um, and then there's even some things thinking ahead to Memorial Day of July, patriotic, um, some new fashion, and, and then there is some, um, there's a new mark map. So some of these Mark fashion pieces are also available in, as a demo. And then on the back, we do have these jewelry pieces too. Um, so, but campaign 11, my biggest tip for campaign 11 is going to be to make use of the bug guard and the fact that we're getting to bug season. Um, especially as you get further in, into April and May. And Campaign 11 is going to be the first one for the month of May. So that's definitely prime time to get people for bug season with the summer. Um, and it's already pretty much hit for the spring. So um, that's going to be what I would capitalize on is the bug guard. And then again, like just kind of looking at what it is that you might want to try yourself and wear and share and, and, and that kind of um, as far as demos are concerned, and just remembering your budget so that you don't go over <laughs> with your demo purchases. Because <laughs> um, where you are here to make money as representatives. And then as far as uh, campaign, that was campaign 11. As far as campaign 12 is concerned, you can see that campaign 12 is a new Avon True Color Ideal Nude Foundation, which is going to be available um, as a Liquid foundation. and then there's also um, a concealer, and so it's a ideal nude cream concealer. It comes in like a lip gloss kind of a tube, except for it's the concealer, and then the ideal nude foundation um, is going to come in this kind of a package here. And you can see though, there's a wide range of shades available, and there is samples available too. Um, so that you can offer samples of the foundation anyway are available so that you can offer those to your customers and, and all um, some information on the products and then again there is some information on, on selling foundation and concealer in here um, and building your orders there's some information this one on the power serum and a stock up offer to get it at a lower cost there's a stock up Offer on Skin So Soft, and then and there's new Skin So Soft product. The um, actually there's two new Skin So Soft products in Campaign 12. The Skin So Soft Fresh and Smooth Moisturizing Shave Gel, um, with, well shave oil. I mean, instead of gel like we already have, it's the shave oil, and um, that one's going to be intro special six ninety nine and more, and um. It says that it's a lighter than shaving cream formula that creates silky smooth glide, moisturizes and leaves skin feeling soft, and it's in a cherry blossom scent. And then the, the Summer Soft is a, another new Skin So Soft product that's peony and sensual vanilla, um, and it, it's comparable to the Winter Soft product um, as far as like how it moisturizes. And... Um, it's offered a fresh new option to the top-selling Winter Soft line, and so it's going to be offered as a creamy body wash and a body butter. Um, and again, with that scent, and that's going to be Intra Special four ninety nine on the body wash and five ninety nine on the body butter in campaign twelve. And then Campaign 12 is going to be a new Mark Magalog focused on, like, tropical. We always do one in the summer that's like tropical. So this one is this year's, and it's Havana <laughs> collection of fashion. 
accessories, as well as a new fragrance. And so the fragrance is called, called Havana Soul, and that's going to be offered as a body scrub, body wash, and a body butter. Um, and it's freshly cut papaya, deep Cuban orchid, and warm velvet wood. And I smelled this on the experience, rubbed the scent. It smells very, very fruity to me. So this is going to be more for people that like the um, fragrances. And then there is some new signature collection pieces. The signature collection is getting to be a wonderful fashion and accessory collection. Um, and then some more signature collection. And then also some other studies and jewelry. Three new charms for the cherished memories. A dolphin, panda, and elephant. And then um, a flower watch and Penn State earrings. It's, um, you can get either the gold tone, which is the heart, or star tone, and they're going to be six nine each. A Wonder Woman watch. Um, a secret earring set that says, Don't ever let anyone dull your sparkle uh, on the box. And then energy bead bracelets, one that's for opportunity, one for healing, and one for inner peace. And the opportunity one is green aventurine, amethyst for healing, and soda light for inner peace. And it just says with metallic color, color beads, and there are semi-precious stone accents. Um... And then just lots of more really awesome <laughs> jewelry ability there. Um, and then some Father's Day jewelry candles that men may not mind, like two new ones, Canyon Mist and Sweet Tobacco. And... Um, also, the Avon Prime fragrance that has been in other countries is now going to be introduced in the United States, and that one is for men. And it's lavender, spearmint, and cedar wood. And I smell this one, and to me, all of our men's scents smell the same, and I know they're not. But so I'm just not the best person to talk to. You want the male fragrances? Um, but anyway, these are new and. Uh, um, with campaign 12 being the end of May, that's going to really be a good time to count Father's Day as well, um, being that people are going to want to start getting ready for that. And the other thing is domestic violence, um, sanctuary for families, branching out empowerment. And so the sanctuary for families is a shelter for domestic violence victims that's in New York. And and I think they offer multiple shelters. Um, but the Avon Speak Out Against Domestic Violence program is going to take a portion of proceeds from this tote, 360 donation for each one. And they are going to uh, donate it towards the shelters through their Speak Out Against Domestic Violence program. And um, the... Artwork was actually made by a child that was living in one of these shelters. And so this is just again, a good cause. Um, you know, we all use totes for lots of different things, especially in the summertime. You're probably going to go to the beach and stuff like that, vacations. Um, and it's just really good to have those totes. And this one is one that you know will be used for a good cause. And the cost for... Um, Customers is going to be eighteen dollars in the brochure with the three hundred and sixty donation, so that's just good to know. Um, and then also, as representatives, if you buy the demo at the demo cost, the three hundred and sixty is still donated um, on your behalf as well. So, for campaign, so in a nutshell, if you're still with me, anyone watching this, um, 
campaign 12 is mostly capital i mean campaign 11 is mostly capitalizing on the bug guard campaign 12 is mostly capitalizing on this new makeup the tote and then also just father's day and um just all of the wonderful that we offer with Avon. I mean, it's hard to do these videos because truthfully, in my experience with campaign planning and stuff like that, you have to take what it is that you like. The best way to market it is going to be marketing something you like by demoing it, sharing it, and, you know, just telling people well, this stuff is awesome for whatever reason. And, um, so it's hard to really say, okay, you want to really capitalize on this and this. But I will say, um, you know, usually the cover is a good indicator, at least one of the that you should try to capitalize on. Um, and then, uh, you know, like I said, the rest of it is basically based on you and your customers and what you know you and your customers enjoy. And, um, you know, just looking out for opportunities to, to, educate yourself and your customers and offer new things um but yeah so that's going to be this video in a nutshell again i appreciate anybody for watching if you like what you see, do subscribe to the live notifications and if you're watching the replay on youtube you can subscribe to the youtube channel i do try to do tip videos and um this year i've been doing over two campaigns at a time but i may start doing one campaign at a time um i'll see but I do campaigns at time because I know that I've covered, like, this is pretty much the month of May in a nutshell, 11 and 12. And, and though I'm doing it as two campaigns at time, I know I've covered the months, um, you know. So, anyway, <laughs> I'll see. I'll play around a little bit, I guess. Um, but, yeah, so thank you again for watching, and I will see everybody with my next video. Bye, guys. Thanks again.